Do you know what is the only Middle Eastern country that has no desert? Yes, this is Lebanon. In Arabic, it is called Al Jamhuriyat Lubnania. Hey, in this video, I'm gonna tell you about Lebanon. Lebanon has high literacy rate and traditional mercantile culture. Lebanon is an important commercial hub for the Middle East. Republic of Lebanon may be a small country, but it is located at the center of Middle Eastern conflicts. It has borders with Syria and Israel. Lebanon has almost 6 million people and 10,450 10, square kilometers. Major language of Lebanon is Arabic, but French, German, English are also spoken here. Lebanon is the oldest country name in the world. It is over 4,000 years old. In modern world, Lebanon once was a colony of France. In 1945, it got independence from France. Before then, Lebanon has been occupied by at least 16 other countries. The flag of Lebanon is so meaningful. The red band symbolizes bloodshed for liberation. The white band means peace and purity. The green cedar tree in the middle is the symbol of Lebanon and represents eternity, happiness and prosperity. Religion plays a major role in Lebanese culture. Lebanon recognizes 18 different religions. According to latest global estimation, 61% of population are Muslim, 30% are Christian. Lebanon has a unique power sharing arrangement between people of different faiths. The president is always a Maronite Christian, the prime minister is always a Sunni Muslim, and the speaker of parliament is always a Shia Muslim. The currency of Lebanon is Lebanese pound. Economy of Lebanon is classified as a developing arbitramical economy. The nominal GDP was estimated 54 billion in 2018, with a per capita GDP amounting 12,000 US dollar in 2018. However, currently Lebanon passing upsetting economic crisis. The capital city of Lebanon is Beirut which is compared with Phoenix because it was destroyed and rebuilt about 8 times. The Law School of Beirut was the first law school in the world. It was a center for the study of Roman law. That is why Beirut became known as the Mother of Laws. Books are written in Cairo printed in Beirut and read in Baghdad. This well-known saying attests the importance of Lebanese printing industry. Lebanon is the biggest printing hub of the world. Lebanon has 5 billion square heritage sites. These are ancient city of Belbik, Muhammad al-Amid Mosque, Sheen of Her Lady of Lebanon, etc. Beirut Capital city is the 10th most popular shopping destination in the world. Lebanon is the first Arab country to permit private radio and TV. Since 1945, it's illegal to raise any foreign flag in Lebanon. Lebanon has one doctor for every 10 people. 70% of Lebanese students go to private schools. The most surprising fact of Lebanon is about 14 million Lebanese people live outside the Lebanon. In fact, there are more Lebanese in Brazil than in Lebanon itself. Brazil alone has 7 million people of Lebanese descent. Other hand, numbers of Syrian refugees in Lebanon is equal to 30% of Lebanese population. The national dish of Lebanon is kibbe. It's a ground lamb and cracked wheat paste dish. Lebanon, the Pradesh of East, is the third greatest number of smokers in the world.
Lebanon produce apples, grapes, tomatoes, potatoes, olives, tobacco, sheep and goats. This country has industries in tourism, banking, jewelry, textiles and chemical products. Fashion designer Ali Saab, wrestler Jakari Shihab, author and philosopher Khalil Gibran, artist Fairuz, politician Rafiq Hariri, Hassan Nasrullah are the most influential Lebanese people in the world. The culture of Lebanon and the Lebanese people emerged from various civilizations over thousands of years. Lebanon was occupied by the Greeks, the Romans, the Persians, the Arabs, the Crusaders, the Ottoman Turks and the French. This variety is reflected in Lebanon's diverse population. The predominant culture is fundamentally conservative and exhibits a great deal of respect for traditions. Drawing on many Arab customs, long-standing Islamic and Christian traditions remain deeply ingrained in social norms and expectations. However, many practices and lifestyles also reflect European influences. This is partly due to its coastline's proximity to Europe, as well as period of France occupation in the 20th century. Ultimately, contemporary Lebanese society is highly diverse. It is common to see both traditional and Lebanese attire and modern European fashion in its cities traced. As such, the Lebanese people are familiar with the plurality of lifestyles and are often capable of easily adapting to other societies. In Lebanon, it is a common culture to eat with family. Eating in Lebanon is tied to family. People almost never eat alone. The Lebanese consider eating out a social and almost aesthetic experience. Hence, the restaurants usually have a pleasant view of which Lebanon's geography affords many. The Lebanese are proud of their tradition of hospitality. This is a culture where it is considered an honor to have a guest in your home. Greetings in Lebanon are an interesting mix of both the French and Muslim cultures. A warm and welcoming smile accompanied by a handshake while saying marhaba is a greeting that can be given without causing offense. About sports, Lebanon is a sports-loving nation. Football, basketball, rugby, these are the most popular sports in Lebanon. 